What's up you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a Young LA for her try on haul for the new women's drop that is dropping February 29th. There are two new collections dropping. So there's the scuba collection and that features shorts, joggers, a mock neck, crop sweatshirt, and a sweatshirt along with a simple tee that matches all the corresponding colors. And then we have the curve collection which is dropping in shorts, leggings, compressions, sports bras, and a mock neck. I want this to be as informational and as quick as possible, so let's just get right into it. It is dropping February 29th at 12 p.m. PST, 2 p.m. CST, and 3 p.m. EST. If you would like to directly support me, you can use code G on all Young LA men's and women's. And I hope you guys enjoy this video and feel free to comment below any fitting questions. I can help you the best I can with your size and weight and info. And let me know. The first fit that I have on right now, this is the scuba crop along with the scuba shorts. I'm a shorty, so I have to stand on the chair for y'all. The crop features a mock neck. It is not tight though, so I had some people asking. I hate tight fitting necks. It is not tight. There is a ton of room for me. Nothing annoying. Nice cuffed wrists. Not too long though. It's honestly perfect. I'm five, four and a half. There's still a little bit of bagginess and room, but it's not overly long where it's annoying. Now, the thing about these is you can crop them or you can uncrop them. Here is fully uncropped. It's a bit of a wider fit, as you can see. I actually still really love this fit. This is kind of how I'd wear it to the gym if I was doing it like a pub cover. And then of course, if you want it to be cropped, there is a little dangly thing on each side. And all you do is you pinch and you pull. Pinch and pull. There we go. It's super cute. You just have to make sure that it's even. And boom. Of course the shorts so right now i'm a bit smaller than i would normally be i'm nine weeks out from bodybuilding shows so i'm super tiny so i did get smalls in these and they're a little big but you do have strings on the inside that way if you fold over you don't have the like annoying string mess that you sometimes have and then it features this rubberized logo it's on the top left for me and the bottom left of the shorts so matching logo placement and of course pockets i love the style of these pockets now I was getting a ton of questions about the material. The material is not thick. I would say it's on the thinner side. It feels like a very athletic style sweatshirt. There's Nike sweatshirts, like those dry fit Nike ones. It is a very similar feeling to that, except it's less staticky. I hate when sweatshirts are static I and mean, like dog hair sticks to them. It's not like that at all. This material is super cool as well because it's like a super non wrinkly. Even taking them out of the packages, there was no wrinkles. This is just hung up. No like drying, no ironing, no dry, like nothing was done to this. And as you can see, the material is just super unwrinkled. And then the inside is like I said, this dry fit material almost. Super soft, super comfy. It is like the craziest material I've ever felt. Next, I have on the matching sweat set. So let's first go over the top and then I'll lower the camera and show you guys the bottoms. This is the scuba sweatshirt in a size small, again, five, four, 125 right now. It is definitely on the baggier side, but there's so many details in the sweatshirt. So this logo is almost branded into the sweatshirt. It's puffed out from the inside, but there's no actual like stitching. Super cool. And then you have the cross neck right here, which I actually prefer. I hate when necks are low because if I don't wear a shirt underneath, you can tell. I really love that it comes up. And of course, a huge hood, perfect hood. The arms are long, but not annoyingly long. They come up and leave a little bit of room on my wrists. Now, my favorite part about the sweatshirt, look at the back. It has that same Young LA branding, but big on the back. And I love that it's minimal because it's not stitched in there or a different color. It is a big branding, but it's minimal, but it just adds to the sweatshirt. For the bottoms, you have a super nice waist right here. You do have strings on the inside and just tuck them right in. And then you also have this nice tightener so you can make them loose, but you can also make them tighter. And they're just your standard jogger fit, so there's nothing super different or crazy. Although the joggers do have the rubberized branding, they don't have the kind of imprinted branding like the sweatshirt. And then, yes, they do have pockets, but the pockets do zipper, which is something I love. So this is the scuba sweatshirt and joggers in charcoal. The next colorway I really wanted to show you guys was the white. So it's a little bit of an off-white. It has a tiny, tiny hint of cream, but it is super white. We're going back on the chair. So I have on the crop with the joggers. I love that there is some space, but it's not super cropped. 
And then of course we have the zipper pockets. I just wanted to show you guys the different ways that you can like wear these items. So obviously you could do the sweatshirt and the shorts, the sweatshirt and the joggers. Now you can do the crop and the joggers or the crop and the shorts. This is another one of the colors, but it is dropping in other colors. So this is oak. It's a bit of a tan color. Also dropping in moss, which is like a lime green. And last it is dropping in black. Be on the lookout for all these colors. The colorways are so, so beautiful. Of course, they can be mix and match, but I'm sure you'd want to wear them as a set. And there is one more item that's dropping in this collection, and those are the simple tees. Next item I'm wearing is the simple tee. So it has the rubberized Young LA right here. It has this little baby tag on the side. Super subtle branding, nothing on the back. It is 100% cotton, so just be aware of that when you buy these, it might shrink. It is a little oversized, not as big as their like traditional ugh, oversized tees. So if you do want it like big, I would size up. It's big on me, but I'm expecting it to shrink a little bit. And it doesn't fully cover my butt. If you want a baggy fit, size up. I would say that these are like a normal to a little bit oversized of a bigger fit t-shirt. And it also matches the Curve Collection sets. So you can totally wear it as a pump cover with one of those. So let's get into now the active wear. First, we have the seamless curve bra and the seamless curve leggings. First off, the bra is super minimal. It does come with padding, has this U-neck shape with thin straps. No, the straps do not dig in at all. And no, it's not adjustable. Here's the back. You have these two straps that cross along with the straps on top. I was getting a lot of questions on if they dig into my back, if it's big back friendly. I will say if you have a big back and your boobs are huge, I would maybe size up. But if you're like smaller chested or a bit bigger than me, you have a wide back, I see no problem. Like there is ton of stretch and room available. It's a little bit big on me. If you have a big back, like don't worry. I would stay true to size. These are for sure true to size. I could have even sized down to an extra small, but I just like sticking with a small. You just have the Young LA branding right here. And of course, nothing on the back. Literally super open back, so flattering. This is the most flattering bra they've ever made. I love it and I love the neck shape. These are the curved seamless leggings. You have a thicker waistband and one seam right here. And then as you guys know, this seam comes into the back at a V shape. There is no scrunch with these leggings, which honestly is just kind of relieving because sometimes I just don't want shorts and leggings literally up my ass, but they are still flattering. You can tell they still make the butt look good, even though they're not literally so far up my butt. Go all the way down to my ankle with some room for the taller girls. If you're tall, don't worry about the leggings. I honestly don't think they're going to be short on you unless you're like literally super tall. So you should be fine. I'm a small in the top and bottoms. Like I said, I'm a bit smaller right now because I am prepping for a bodybuilding show. So think about me, but like 10 pounds heavier. <laughs> Again, this is in the color pine. And of course there is shorts, compressions, and mock neck long sleeves dropping in this color. So just be on the lookout and pick your color and pieces that you want and you can color coordinate. This next item deserves so much love. They dropped similar seamless long sleeves for Black Friday. They did not have this mock neck. No, the mock neck is not super tight. As you can see, there's room, it's comfy, it's beautiful. I worked out in this and I felt like a bad bitch. It looks so good on your delts. First off, you have this detailing down the arm. I love that they added this, just subtle details to really add to the piece. No thumb holes, thank God, I hate thumb holes. Waist band, the Young LA logo on the back that corresponds to the shorts. It is like literally the perfect set. Now, a lot of people were asking the difference between the core shorts and the curved shorts. I would say one difference a little bit is the length. If I wanted to pull these down, I totally could. As you can see, they're not super short. My butt cheeks are not showing, but if I want to pull them up and do the whole like gym girl thing, I can. And now I can make them a lot shorter. I am wearing a small in the shorts and this mock neck and it's perfect. The sleeves, there is some room for my tall girlies. It'll be long enough on you. The crop might be a little bit shorter on you, but as you can see, it's like kind of mid waist for me. And there's not too much action going on here. I feel like they made it a really good length where like it's cropped, but not too cropped. And I feel super exposed. The next outfit I wanted to show you guys was the sports bra shorts set. So this is in cider. Again, a small in the shorts and the sports bra. So flattering. This color especially looks good on all skin types. They all do, but I'm in love. Here we are. Same minimal sports bra built in pads. Open back. And here are the shorts. So as we can see, obviously, this is a lot more skin showing. But because the shorts are high-waisted, there's not a ton of core showing. And yes, my back is open, but my butt is not out. You can always pull these down if you wanted to. 
This is like go-to gym fit. Now I'm sure you guys are like, okay, Gianna, you're selling us on these clothes. What are the prices? So the sports bra is actually going to be retailing for $30, which is kind of a steal. That is with code G, you're 15% off, 30 bucks, and these shorts are going to be retailing for 36. Here is the pricing chart. You guys can take a screenshot with all the items that are dropping. And this is with my code, the discount. Prices are honestly not bad. Super affordable, snag a few pieces and say it's a treat for yourself. The next item I have on is the curved compression. This is my favorite item in the entire drop. If you guys follow Young LA for her or you're a fan of the brand, you saw the last compressions that dropped last month were a bit more of a crop and the sleeves were a bit shorter. They were kind of similar to something like that. These, they made more of a t-shirt fit. It comes lower down your arm and this is also lower. It covers all the way down to the top of my butt and there's no skin showing between the shorts. And underneath, I'm wearing this color sports bra. I will say that this green color is like a tiny bit sheer. I am wearing pink underwear and you can't see, so it's not too sheer. But if you were to get the compression and you wore like black bra underneath, you would be able to see it. So if you're planning on getting this compression, I would probably wear a white sports bra underneath or get the matching sports bra for this color. I wanted to show you guys what the compression and the shorts look like together. This is like a perfect leg day fit. Now on the compression, you have this Young LA branding. It is a rubberized logo. And then you also have these seams right here. There's like this thinner material right here. It gives like an athletic feel. I wanna show you guys on the gray color. There you go. I love that they have those. So it's not just like a plain compression t-shirt. It has some shape to it. And it also goes down to the sides. You can see that nice detailing. This is the best product I think they've ever dropped. And I'm just super excited about it. Stay true to size. It is compressed for sure. Could I have worn an extra small? Yes, but it is a little tight on my arms, as you can see. So I think it would have been too tight. So definitely stay true to size on honestly all of these pieces. Might be able to get away with sizing down on the bottoms, but honestly, I wouldn't push your luck. Next outfit is the same thing. I'm wearing the Curve Compression Tee, of course, same detail, but I paired it with the leggings. This is like a super casual fit. You can wear this for lifestyle. Like I paired it with the New Balance and I think it is so cute, but you can also wear it to the gym. I would say this is perfect for like a shoulder day or even a leg day. I will say the thing that I love about the Curve Collection and it is really comfy. It is compressive, but it's not overly compressive to where I cannot wait to get home and take it off. Here we are again, the compression meets my glutes and it's the perfect flattering fit. The leggings will be retailing for $44 with my code and the compression will be retailing for 36. The compressions are going to sell out so fast. Honestly, I believe within five to 10 minutes. So if you are looking to get the compression, be ready. The last items that are dropping, these already dropped. So I want to make this a very clear the bandeaus are for the older Curve collection that dropped on Black Friday. There was a manufacturing like lateness thing with the bandeaus, so they're dropping them now with this new Curve drop. This is not the new red. This is in the color Spice, and they go with the Spice leggings or shorts that dropped on Black Friday. So right now I have them paired with the leggings. I've gotten a ton of questions about the bandeaus. Do they stay up? Should I size down? Blah, blah, blah. Size down if your boobs are small. My boobs are small. I got a size small and I definitely should have gotten an extra small. If you are bigger chested, I honestly would probably look for a different option or you can try staying true to size if they're not like huge. But if you have huge boobs, honestly, I would look at the other sports bra. Here is a close up of the bandeau. Also, a lot of people are asking, yes, there is grip on the whole inside, literally from front to back. There's grip around the whole sports bra, removable, built in pads. One thing about the pads that is not my favorite is they're kind of small. They're only like this. Now, I guess that's as big, honestly, as they could have fit in here. I guess I just wish they were like a little bigger. And then you have the Young LA logo down the back. Like I said, this is an older color. This is with the old curve collection that dropped on Black Friday. Basically size down in the bandeaus if you have small boobs. As you can see, it's kind of falling on me, but that's not because the bandeau is badly manufactured. That's because my boobs are too small for a size small. I needed an extra small for it to be a little tighter and for the stick to actually have a purpose. Right now, it's not even tight enough on my skin to actually have like the friction to stay up. I don't know my bra size, so I can't really tell you guys that. I think I'm an A cup as of right now because I'm nine weeks out, like I said. So as you can see, pretty lean up top, 
that body fat is gone. If you guys have any more questions about the bandos or need help with sizing, go ahead and comment down below and I will be sure to help you. The bandeau is actually the cheapest product that is launching and it's crazy because this one actually has so much hype. This is $29 with my code. All right, so that is it for the try on haul. I hope this was helpful. I hope you guys figured out what pieces you want. Comment down below if you have any questions. Again, this drop is February 29th. 12 p.m. PST, 2 p.m. CST, 3 p.m. EST. Do not be late because this is going to sell, especially the compressions and probably the shorts and the sports bras. Those are like definitely the top products. So be ready, be there, and I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, and use code G on your Young LA purchases. Love you guys. Bye.